Welcome back. So I thought I'd just do a little tip video. So if you ever do a Bleak Walker Paladin, uh, it's in your best interest to get Cruel Disposition. And one way to get a, one point of disposition off the very start of the game is to kill the caravan when you start. So this video is showing you how it's possible to kill the caravan on a level 1 on Path of the Damned. Now, this works with literally any race. I'm just going to click this one. Dave, you want it on a slightly easier mode? Uh, Moon God-like would probably be better, but uh, you can use any. And uh, I think for, s for some playthroughs, having prone defense and stun defense is actually quite useful against dragons, mostly. Bleak Walker? Because why not? Smash out maximum might. Reduce your intellect. 18 resolve. Into perception. Forty constitution should be enough. The living lands for this setup, though you can actually pick any one if you have a preference, since you can buy almost all the equipment you need at the start. But I'll show you how to do that. Athletics mechanics, it's probably semi important to have athletics in the starting build. This is all personal flavor. Suitable Bleak Walker name. So I'm just going to speed through this to get to the part that's important, but uh, I am starting from the beginning. Anyone need supplies? I've got sundries for sale. Loot everything, the two potions. So essentially you're collecting the berries so that you can dispatch Stefan. If you fight the caravan before you do the berry collection, he spawns in the fight too and he just shoots you for the whole time and uh, it makes it near impossible. Speed for this. Gotta find the hidden pistol. Back to camp. And we're going to buy uh, some utility items for this fight. Well, to hold say, is there anything you need? I'm a trader. Something else? Okay. Hunting bow. Pike. Actually, we'll go for quarter staff. 
quarter staff pike, whatever you want. It's basically you using a weapon with reach potion. Going to sell her weapons and armor as well. Going to give her a small shield. Something else you need? Equip our potions. Alright. Turn AI off. Very important. So, there's a sweet spot there. So, you can see how the, the circle that outlines the NPC sort of covers a little bit of the wagon. You don't want the NPC here. It has to be out there. Yeah. Right? And this should work. Hmm? So get up really... Yeah, fix that up. Yeah. Get up really close to Kalisa. Equip your bow. And we're going to start the fight. We're going to have some caravan people come from around the side. We'll kill them. And then, essentially, we're letting Kalisa beat on, uh, on us while we reach over her and do damage to the actual harder NPCs in the camp. Alright, so we'll drink a beer. Let's go. Okay, switch to quarter star. So one thing to remember is lay on hands at this level, it's your entire. It's more than your mass hit points. So you, if you're not taking too much damage, you can leave it to the very last minute. The reason we gave Kalisa a shield is that she that she do wields otherwise. Keeping an eye on our life. So we use lay hands now. So we're completely healed now. So now, tricky bit is sometimes you have to uh, get the NPCs to re-engage by using a bow to bring it back in again. All right, he's back. And you keep Kalisa alive until the next NPC that would engage you is a caravaner. Then you'd rather have the caravaner beat on you rather than her. But um. So he's buffed himself, which is annoying, but... So we're going to start using our potions soon.
Because this does nearly our whole life too, but it takes a little while. So we, I usually do it about the late, like the teens of some kind. 18, 19. So we can, uh, we'll use the potion. Just... Alright, we'll kill Kalisa now. accidentally double clicked the potion unfortunately but uh, this should be easy now so the next hardest NPC is uh, Hayden so we're going to uh, just keep killing the caravanas until we get to the one just before and he'll reach over the caravana to kill that rogue. So we're still good, we've got a whole potion that is basically complete heal in this level as well. And you can do this with any of the, the races, you don't need to do anything special doesn't have to be uh, any in particular. There we go. We just cleared the camp. We're in Silent List now. And you get your one cruel disposition, which automatically affects this by one point already. That's it. Hope it helps.